The Senate Committee on Lands, Housing and Urban Development is holding this public hearing to get inputs from critical stakeholders on the bill to regulate the mode of payment of rent on residential apartments and office spaces in the Federal Capital Territory. The proposed legislation seeks to reduce advance payment for house rents for new tenants to three months and thereafter proceed on monthly payment schedule. According to the sponsor of the bill, the proposed law will make life less stressful for low-income earners in the FCT as it warns that yearly house rent payments breed corruption and huge inequality. I have a conviction that tenants in Abuja are worth it. And some of the bills that people pay are bills that they want to some people can pay. They want to do a thing that not just try the means at which of which they got what they are paying for. The Nigeria Labour Congress applauds the bill, noting that it is a reasonable intervention for the weak and vulnerable in the country. However, the Estate Surveyors and Valuers Registration Board of Nigeria opposes the enactment of a law arguing that it does not protect the interest of some critical stakeholders in the housing sector. We are pleased with the content and intent of this bill. It is common knowledge that landlords, almost without exception, continue to take advantage of hapless tenants, majority of whom cannot afford the indulgences of such landlords. Section 1 of the bill provides that the bill is applicable to within the federal capital territory. But it is interesting to note that most of the people that the bill seeks to protect are residents, are not residents of every city. They situate in Mariraba, Kado, and all villages in the Nasrawa city. The Senate committee is expected to collate all the views at this hearing and present a report to the Senate at plenary.